Go. All right, I'm with you. I'm Scorecab. I'm your host. And with me today is Duke Squirrel. <laughs> Duke Squirrel. Squirrel. What? Starting to get old, Scorecab. Starting to get old. Uh, Gaia hey, Vilcax, Grafud the Worshipper, Balthazar Black, Thamior Lyodin, and Blarf the Babby Eater. <laughs> Yeah! Also, Blarf the Babby Eater. Also, Nico. Uh, I like how it says Blarf the Babby Eater, but then when he rolls, it's corrected to Baby Eater because it's his uh, character sheet. Of course. Uh, so, uh, Blarf the Baby Eater rolls listen. He does not hear any babies in the quietness of. I rolled a fucking 27! You can hear everything <laughs> else. Get some babies! <laughs> you can hear what everything he hear? else, however. What does he hear? Is I it gotta hear everything. Everything. We haven't even started yet, and thing. we're having to deal with this crap. Okay, so... So, you guys are about there. Right there. So, in the previous what? episode, uh, Blarf ended up yodeling in this horrible Dead Man's Gorge tunnel. Are you gonna draw and fuck? Stop God drawing damn. dicks on my map! <laughs> <laughs> Already? Griffin, uh, come on, that was a one-time thing, you're ruining it! <laughs> He's going God ass! God damn it! Okay. Okay, okay. That's fine. Alright, I'm done. I won't do it again. I'm done. I'm done. Okay, so... <laughs> I'm throwing out my hands. Okay, so, next up... Uh, right, what were we... Oh my... Okay, so in the previous episode, uh, we end up having, well, Blarf end up yodeling in the Dead Man's Gorge, which revealed a, end up disturbing the creatures that live in here, which revealed to be a bunch of mutated owl bears that, uh, new mounts, <laughs> new mounts, that, uh, yes. uh really Really wanted to get y'all's flesh, however, do, this is the reason why you carry light. However, a shadow being ended up putting out this light, or some of y'all's light, and you guys lost Tim one, but hey, nobody really cared about him, so not a big problem. Uh, what was left over of Tim one was just an arm, you guys tossed it aside, and pretty much everything else is going by normally. Uh, yeah, there, nothing worth mentioning. I just want to talk about the pun that uh, uh, Balthazar made yesterday about the hand. And how and how uh, Blarf is now going to fucking murder him for taking the pun. I had been planning okay. this whole time. <laughs> we also had a very enthralling conversation about putting soul logs up our butt. Yep. Oh yeah, Matt. Uh, how canon is that? How canon is my <laughs> epic poem? <laughs> <laughs> How canon is your endless butthole? Um, butthole. Uh, you probably could fit a cannon up there. It sounds pretty endless. <laughs> probably, probably not gonna happen. Or probably not gonna happen. I understand. This isn't supposed to be fun. <laughs> but be serious, realistic. Okay, so. So, you guys are at about that red dot. You guys are, uh, end up moving into the tunnel. Blah, 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 blah. About there. Uh, when, uh, the caravan comes to a sudden stop. The, uh, Tim 2. <laughs> that, was that was Tucker that time. That was not me. I am across the room. We can still hear you very clearly. I have to admit, it's, it's can, almost. Can we, can we be mature adults about this? Can we disable? Hold on. No, there, there's sadly no setting to Griffin's... disable drawing. Otherwise, I would have done it eons ago in my other games. Same. If you wanted mature adults, you really should have just stuck with us, dude. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Touché, touché. So. So, uh, the caravan comes to a sudden stop, and, uh, Tim 2, uh, well, I guess now the only Tim, right? Should we just start calling him Tim? 
No, no, he's still Tim 2. He's still and Tim and 2. Remember, no, 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 Tim 1 is gone, and if we can erase him from my memory, I that. He's still Tim 2. Still Tim 2, okay. No, no, he's Look, got a it's like he's... Scott Pilgrim. No, 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 he got a promotion, he got a promotion. He's Tim 3 now. Tim 3, okay. So Tim 3, uh, <laughs> ends up, uh, stopping the caravan. Yeah. Tim 1 plus 2. Uh, and you, you have, uh, this has also taken the course of a few days, so you're all well rested now. You're all... Uh, well rested. You've uh, all prepared your spells once again, uh, which uh, reminds me, guy, don't forget to actually uh, take note of the spells that you've prepared. Uh, okay, I... Or not, you know, we, we just kind of wing this by this point. Um, the man, uh, Tim3 ends up uh, looking back at you guys and says, Alright, I'm tired. Let's set up camp here. Uh, and note that he's been awake for what must have been ten days straight. I, I, I'm gonna say, we're stopping? That's gonna cut the profits. <laughs> only a little bit. You know, you're not the only one who can drive. Uh, this is true, but, uh, we're going in, we're... I volunteer Thamior. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> he, he says, these are unexplored territory, and I'd much rather not lose the caravan due to some pitfall or some crap like that. Oh, come on. How bad could it be? Very. It could be very bad. Okay, I'm going to go up to the creature that's driving this whole thing. Okay. The rock knocker? Yeah. I'm going to whisper in its ear, uh, tell me your secrets. What are you hoping and, to gain from this? <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna do a handle animal check. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. What does he say? Uh, the, <laughs> the animal looks at you, and then, like, gives you a friendly, like, lick. Just... No. <laughs> it seems to really I like I say we you. put it to death and eat its rotting corpse. <laughs> oh, no! Tim My three. mule can not tell me its secrets, no matter how hard I try. Jesus. Tim 3 looks at you and says, What secrets are you trying to get from it? These things have secrets abound. Yeah, I already know where the money is. There's really no other secrets. Mm. It, it really does. Like, I don't, I don't even like showering in Brandon's place. What? <laughs> <laughs> you okay there, Brad? Who the fuck is this? Uh, that's my bro. Can, can he voice Tim 3? Uh, hey, uh, bro, would you like to voice Tim 3? Voice Tim 3? Go ahead, do, do a voice for Tim 3. Any voice? Any voice, go for it. Are you looking for, like, goofy, silly? Just do anything. Just say and do anything. My name's say, Tim. I'm Tim 3 and I suck. Say, my name's Tim 3 and I suck. Um, my name's Tim 3 and I suck. Okay, perfect. Now go take a shower, like you stink. <laughs> Smell me. Shout out to shout out to Matt's smelly brother. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Tim three. Matt, are you related to Sod? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not nice. <laughs> you created the Sod hole to make fun of him, didn't you? No. Well, well, you know, if like, I mean. If if the sod hole is the hole of life, does that mean that sod is life? Sod is okay. I'd say sod is love. Is, sod is life. So, okay. So where was I? Right. Um, I can tell you something for sure. Sod is not life. <laughs> so, so uh, sod is the breaker of death. So. Tim three looks. He's got at his custom decks so. though. Tim three looks at you, Blarf, and says, "We're not putting him down." We need him to pull the caravan. Mm -hmm. I think I think Blarf here can can uh, pull the caravan by himself. We're pretty good. Do not try to convince Tim Three to put down this creature. Stop it, you two, mm -hmm. you fucking bastards. We're not putting Let's him see. down unless under dire circumstances. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, can I use? Oh, fuck. Can I use diplomacy to uh, convince him to put down the rock knocker? Sure. I see one. Yeah, I'm gonna. Oh no, you better not roll good. 
I will, I will jump you. I will pull you into the corner and jump you if you try. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put down. I'm gonna get rid of some diplomacy. Where is it? Okay, I, I also need you to put forth the, uh, the <laughs> arguments. I'm gonna put it forth. Uh, you can see that this magnificent beast is very tired. He really doesn't deserve to put under. <laughs> I rolled a 25. No, I'm gonna jump him. I'm gonna jump him before he says shit. Can I jump him? <laughs> You're gonna have to do a jumping uh, check for that one. Uh, it's ridiculous. You get a negative 20. Uh, he ends up saying, we're still not putting him down. Thank you, Matt. <laughs> if you had rolled a critical, he really would have considered it. But, uh... <laughs> But he, but he says, you. we're not putting, we're not putting our rock knocker down. We need him to pull Can we give down. him a name? No. Can we, we give put, him a name? Can we put Gaia down? Can we no. give him a name? No, okay. I'm good with Gaia. If I can get you guys to uh, go ahead and put names, e each of you get to put one name in the chat. Let's go ahead. Wait, wait, wait. Is this names that our characters would say? Uh, yes. Or Okay. Names for what? Damn it. Uh, for the okay. rock doctor. Balthazar oh. would not recommend calling him Mr. Snuggles. Just to be perfectly clear. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, you are a rogue. Hey, Barf, he's not a baby. Don't say that. Oh, what does a rock knocker look like once again? Uh, it, can... Something that knocks rocks. It, it, uh, it's it ha probably big for a and knocks. General snuggles. description: It has the body of a hippo, uh, the head of a hornless rhino, and then a really shitty white mane that stretches from his forehead down to its neck and then around. Oh, I looked up rock knock and I got something from Dragon Age Origins. Yeah, I know. Yeah. That's I, uh, like that's that's just a helmet though. Wait a minute. Who's the hippo from Madagascar? Oh, good lord. Julia. <laughs> Gloria? Gloria. Oh, yeah. that was it. Gloria. That's my name. I'm gonna go with... <laughs> Alex the Lion. <laughs> Alex the Lion! Oh, wait. Can I... Can I, uh, replace food with something else? Uh, sure. Okay. Rip. <laughs> Baseball. Baseball. <laughs> okay. So, uh... We should do a, uh, Twitter poll. <laughs> yep. So, uh, for... To roll a dice, it is backslash roll 1d5. Oh. <laughs> There's this thing that came up from the Madagascar Wiki, and it what? said, Moto Moto is a handsome hotamus. So and I thought it said he plays hide and seek. So, uh, his name from this point on will be Rippo. Okay, I'm Yeah, that. perfect. Damn it. If we were voting, knocker. If we were voting, because I know no one would vote for Pole Beast, it would have been Rippo. It would have been Alex the Lion. I, I actually think Alex the Lion had a good chance, but uh, Rippo... I think, I, is pretty I cool. think Rippo is probably the most original out of uh, all of those. Well, yeah, all of them were... <laughs> either shit... Or like my like two of them are from Madagascar. <laughs> so 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 out of nowhere. Are we not gonna wait a minute? Are we not gonna talk about the the other dick that was just drawn? Oh no, I saw it. I'm just not. I'm not gonna say anything. Uh, That's so, fine. So uh, so out of nowhere, all of you get uh, end up getting this idea that the creature's name is Rippo. You're not exactly sure what gave you this. <laughs> Uh, this influence, but from this point on, it's you obvious. identify this creature as Rippo. It, it's pretty yeah, obvious. Obviously, it's telepathic. Yeah, it's a psionic. Duh. Rippo the psionic. Rippo the psionic. R Rippo the low-level psionic rock knocker. Okay. Yep. So, um, so, uh, the man, so, Tim3 ends up, uh, uh, going amongst all of you and says, okay, so go ahead and set up camp. We're going to we're going to map the rest of the way on foot, and I want all of us to be fully rested. And by us, I mean me. So everybody set up camp, and someone take watch. Balthazar is going to uh, point at Rippo and say, "Rippo can take watch." 
Fuck you and your boy He says, toy. unfortunately not. R Ripple has to stay here. And we're going to move a bit further from here so that Ripple... <sighs> Ripple is safest by himself. As is your mule. Are, are you guys okay? Like, are you... <laughs> I don't know what's happening. I was just okay. gonna... I thought it was just on the side. Just keep going. So... So, uh... Despite any arguing that you guys might have... Ooh, that's thunder. Hey guys, it's gonna rain. It's, it's gonna rain. rain! It's gonna rain! Wait a minute! Oh, yeah, no, it's gonna rain. yeah, it is. It's gonna rain for you guys and not for me. Yeah, fuck you, Joseph. I'll email you some. <laughs> I'll send you an envelope full of it. I love that. So, um, I, I believe two of you have tents, correct? And the rest of you just have bedrolls? I have. Yeah, I got a tent. I got. We tent. share. Me and me and Blarf share a tent. I don't Who know. If you you kind of didn't uh, do your work today. And, uh, uh, Turak has his own tent, which is the, uh, big one right there. You guys can have those two shitty ones. How come he gets one big tent and we get the shitty ones? Who am I gonna sleep with? Am I just gonna sleep out here? I'll sleep out by the fire. I'll sit in the fire. Well, I mean, actually, we, we, we do have to have at least one person on watch. Okay, I'll sit on watch. Um, which, uh, after you guys have set up your tents and bedrolls and... Uh, he is up, uh, the, uh, Turak ends up setting the fire with, uh, all of this, uh, uh, all of these vines and whatnot. He ends up pulling out this kind of makeshift tower device that he ends up placing right here. Clo oh, whoops. <laughs> I didn't reveal it at all. He places right there, right next to the fire. Uh, and he ends up saying, okay, so who's taking watch? Larf, would you like to take watch? Uh, I'll take watch. I'm not gonna do I'll... that. No, Who's no, I, I'd rather die. Who's taking watch? Balthazar's just gonna climb uh, up. I will take watch. Oh, it's raining now. Climbed up. I think that's a good idea. So, so Balthazar climbs up. Uh, did uh, did you try and do it sneakily so that he didn't see you, or nope? It was just Balthazar. He audibly sighed whenever yeah. no one volunteered and went up. Okay. I volunteered. He, he says, Balthazar, if you want, you can sleep and Gaia can take first watch. Okay, he's going to drop down from... Well, how, how, wait, how big is the tower? Uh, the tower stands up about 10 feet. How cold is this place? It's okay. fairly cool. Fairly he's cool. going to... It's like, it's like a, have you, Griffin, you remember when we went to the cave in Kentucky? That's like, it was like really, it was really like nice chili. Yeah, I remember I like that. To, I like to think of it like that. Yeah, like, like, if you We're gonna have to take off both of our clothes and get together. Consume <laughs> heat. I mean, that works. <laughs> Josie's told me this is a fact. This is what they told me in Twilight when I watched that movie. Oh my god. E even though one of them ha should have a body that is like zero degrees. Yeah, sure. So sounds sounds like a plan. Any case, wait, wait, one body that? Is that zero degrees? No, it was it was Jacob from the movie. He was like a oh. wolf and he's like oh, yeah, super okay. like literally yeah, hot. Edward, Edward could only watch. He could only stay he was like cucked to oblivion. He just had to watch them undress. <laughs> he loved it. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, um, so Thamior, he has, he has, uh, chosen his little, uh, knapsack. Uh, Balthazar has taken a tent, and, of course, Grafud and, uh, Blarf Davis. are sharing a tent. And then, uh, <laughs> Gaia is on first watch. So, um, how are you guys going to be splitting up the watch? Is it just going to be one person all night? Or are you guys going to trade, uh, at some point? Every night. Um, first I'm gonna do a listen check for a baby. We already- we already <laughs> took care of this. We haven't- we haven't moved. Nah, it's gonna be guy all the time, every night. Yeah, but I'm in my bed and I just wanna do so before I, you know, hit the hay. 
can I fake a baby cry like like before? Like someone else did it before, wasn't it, Balthazar? You, you, can you I do really it? want to try and do that to Blarf? It, it was I'll you. Kill you. I'm up in the tower. He can't do anything. He can knock the tower down into the fire. I wanted to jump into the fire in the very beginning. I'm gonna do list check. Yes. Did you make it? I made it. Oh, good. good. It was a little wet, but it would have been way worse. Dude, you're so. I went professional. Your brain is going sideways. Your brain is going sideways. Okay, open that window, William. Uh, I don't know, Matthew. You might blow in. Just, just, you just might as well remove the recording. Uh -huh. okay, delete it. Okay, so. Sure, delete the private conversations that. Uh, that's fine. Okay, so. Uh, so you you guys are just gonna have what one person doing? stay throughout the entire night. I'll rotate in. So, uh, so you uh, so the plan is to be here for about twelve hours. So Balthazar, you're gonna rotate in at six at the six hour mark. I I, I was thinking that since there are probably at least three people willing, it would be more like every four hours we switch. That way, uh, I won't do that. Sleep. I need nine hours of baby sleep. Uh, you'd be getting 12. I'll rotate. Okay, so there we go. Bal Balthazar, Thamior, and uh, Gaia each get 8 hours of sleep. Okay. Okay. Then, uh, of course, Blarf and Griffud get however much they get. Okay. So, 12 hours. So let's start doing this up. First hour. No, second hour. Whoop. That one doesn't count. Nope. Third hour. Nope. And fourth hour? No. Okay, so Gaia, uh, throughout your experience here, uh, you do not see anything for the first four hours. Sweet. So, so I'm up next for watch. Indeed. I'm, I'm just gonna wave her into my tent. Okay. Bum, bum. Bum. Oh, I'm still there. Okay. So, <laughs> what's going on in the tent? Am I allowed to inquire about what's going on in this tent? <laughs> you don't want to know. Oh yeah, no. what is Every going tent on? Every tent is fun, and oh, if he does any more, I'm gonna break his legs. Oh yeah, what is going Can on go in y'all's ear tent? Can I go check and see what's going on in the tent? <laughs> it's for science. It's for the book. <laughs> He's like, I think Griffin's got a boner. <laughs> Well then, I just, I just. No, no. I mean, it's I dick can. Butt. It's dick butt. Just can I still one. check? Oh, you're right. Hold on. Uh, can I do like I'm a? Not that good of an artist, or... but uh, let me try to draw dick butt. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'm not have a dick drawing montage in any of these bugger videos. Uh, we're gonna need it. We are going to need it. Okay, okay. Yeah. Clean up your mess. <laughs> Dick draws. Clean up your mess, oh, Blarf. The biggest load I've ever seen. <laughs> mess. This, this is like a record breaker. Like, like, it's like, uh, how big is the load? You, you know, I, Ten feet. I, I like to think that, like, that, that the cloth that the tent is made of isn't even, like, the color it used to be. It's just covered in white from like like there's stains of white on the inside and outside <laughs> yeah matt you might I really want to just clear wanna, the drawings i want to legitimately know what's going on in the tent i guess it's oh, not I, I deleted all of you control z control z uh nope, that does not work uh, you killed us all <laughs> fuck you fuck you tucker I'd like to do okay. hey, hey, i don't do know that shit that was griffin it was griffin no, what the f <sighs> fucking Griffin? You're not gonna be my disciple if you keep this shit up. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna draw Rippo. I'm gonna draw Rippo. Okay. Get everybody. I swear to God, I'm gonna murder you. I'm gonna murder you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna body slam you against the fucking chair, you asshole. Tucker's just messaging me stuff. He's messaging me dirty things. I feel raped. It's what you deserve for what you did. 
dirty talk, that's what he deserves. Okay. <laughs> I went ahead and drew in the uh, vials of light charging. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a dick. It's it's the vials. Well, I'm of gonna light. I'm gonna draw the rock on. <laughs> it's it's a twenty five oh, pound vial of light plus three small ones because three I'm, of us have. You know light. what? I really want to make sure nothing's going on. I seriously do want to check in the tent. God damn it. Okay. Okay, so... So Gaia is going to check the tent. You want me to roll anything for it? Like a... Like... Nah. I'd like to show Griffin my stones. What do you want me to roll? So... No, no I, I'm saying that... Well, well, are you trying to do this discreetly, or...? Okay, so go ahead and uh, you guys are gonna make a contested roll. So you will roll a uh, high the, the check. Roll is a big uh, penalty. Yeah, I, I guess. Roll 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 you send me a hide versus. No, it would be moved silently, I think, because uh, they're asleep, it? or they should be asleep. I don't know. Like uh, I don't know. Grafud and Blarf, are you two asleep? It's been yeah, four we're hours. both asleep. Okay, so yeah, roll move silently versus those two uh, listen. Yeah. And they get an, and they get a negative since they're asleep. So. Me? I got four. Okay, I get so uh, that's a critical failure. So no need to roll. A uh, guy goes to check in uh, to check inside y'all's tent, and uh, it sounds like there are pots and pans. Connected to Gaia's <laughs> robe, just like banging well, about. She like trips and falls. Nobody boop a dot boop a doop a foul. Say again. I, I could think of a better crit fail. What? She knocks <laughs> her tent down. Well, I was about to get to that. Ah, uh, okay. It, it, it sounds like there are just pots and pans connected to her robe. She ends up like slipping and falling, and she ends up taking out one of the uh, sticks that's holding up the tent in the. And the tent just kind of drapes oh, yeah. over you two. On the other <laughs> hand, this wakes me up. Grapple her! No, you can't grapple me yet! Do it. I wake up, and I want to see what the commotion's about. I think someone's attacking me, so I pull on my greatsword. Uh, uh, there, there is a on tent top on top of you guys. Uh, what should I roll to uh, get also, out? Also, um, you Don't guys... I assume you guys are not sleeping in your armor, right? Uh, I'm sleeping in my, uh, cold weather wear. Okay, uh, because, uh, actually I believe Grafud can because he has endurance, but the rest of you, uh, cannot sleep in armor. But, yeah, uh, I do. Balthazar, I presume that you put on your armor after you, uh, got out of bed? Yeah, and... My armor is not as hard as I think everyone else's is to put on. Yeah. It's just throw on the vest, make sure that it's tight. Oh wait, Shoulder. Gaia made a loud noise. We're about to be attacked by more owl bears. Yeah. She didn't yell though. Yeah. And then she made uh, a loud noise. Matt described it as pots and pans clanking against each other. Yeah, but she didn't yodel into the chasm. Into hey, the that was impressive. <laughs> Impressive, uh, yes. Stupid, yes. And I presume that, uh, Theramur, Thir you won't really suffer because th this is vine. Y you're wearing vines. You, uh... Yeah. You're wearing yeah. bedding. Yeah. You're, you're, yeah, you're wearing comfortable shit. Like, all you really do is kind of, like, remove the, uh, the hard vine, and then you just, like, lay there like this, and then whenever it happens, you just go, huh? And it just, like, attaches to you. That's what I assume happens with you. So well, yeah, I have to sleep in the wild often. So. Yeah. So his armor is also a bed. So Blarf and uh, and Grafud, you two wake up surprised to see that your tent has fallen and is laying on top of you guys. Who's that? Uh, and Gaia. I pull out is... my great sword and I run out. Right, the tent is on top of you, so oh, no, you don't. Shit. You have to get out of the tent. Yeah. Does now. Okay. And um, what do I have to roll? Uh, well, no, you, you don't have to roll, you just have to, like, crawl out of the tent. Uh, actually, I'd even say that you could try and lift the tent off of you. Alright, I'm gonna do a strength check to, uh, lift the tent off me. Okay, go for it. And I'm gonna say that Gaia is the anchor. What? 
So, so they have to lift your weight <laughs> plus plus ten. So yeah, yeah, because you only weigh ninety five pounds, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. They only <laughs> they only needed twenty <laughs> in order to uh, a combined total of twenty to lift you up. So yeah, he so oh. <laughs> throws the tent off, and you off of it, uh, off of him, oh. and uh, you kind of. S uh, you're you're still there, but you're kind of like, you're you're now you are now covered by the tent, Gaia. Uh, would you like to okay. roll? Would you like to try and hide within the tent? I would love to hide within the tent. I'd like to do a listen check to see who's attacking me. Uh, a listen <laughs> Wait, or a at spot? this point. At this point, actually, I think it'd be more of a spot armor check. Armor no, I listen for it. My eyes are not necessary. Uh, Balthazar, are you just watching this or? Uh, well, I just finished getting my armor on for my watch, because okay. I assumed so... that this was Gaia waking me up. Okay. I step outside, and then I just stare. Uh, two so, seconds, and so... I just roll die and go to the tower. So, Blarth, uh, roll a spot check to see if you, uh, see this. Uh, I mean, I have dark vision, so does that help? Uh, no, because she is obscured by the tent. The tent, uh... Yeah. Yes! So you are able to see her, and uh, also looking around, you are able to see Balthazar just kind of casually walking towards the, uh, uh, towards the pop out tower. Pop out tower, and uh, so so you you clearly know that Gaia is uh, has is hidden within your tent, and that uh, Balthazar is, has also awoken and is heading towards the. Uh, the watchtower and Thamior is just over there doing, you know, sleeping. Actually, uh, I would, Thamior, I think that you would probably wake up from all the commotion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I am awake. I'm just kind of lying there, though. Yeah, yeah he, I, 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 I guess he's trying to pull back his sleep. I, I, I like to think that, like, every night before he goes to bed, he just, like, uses the vines to, like, bondage himself against the ground. Like, yes. <laughs> But that's just uh, you're, you're, you're a bit robotic on my end. A bit robotic on your end. Yeah. Me too. Uh, I'd like to yeah. grapple Gaia. Probably the storm. So you're don't grab to, uh, me. Uh, you're I mean, like, him tying die. himself, tying himself to the ground, kind of makes sense if you've been living in the woods all your life. Yeah. So that way, like an eagle can't just pick you up on the way by. But he hasn't been living in the woods. It's been Think about it. Underground. underground. Me, me. Oh yeah. It means that an okay. owl bear can't. Then a bat can't pick you up on the way by. There, there are giant bats. Um, yep. So, Matt, I would like to grab her, and since she's on the ground, do I get a bonus? You do uh, get plus four. You did. You, uh, you, you also did not actually stand up, did you? You're still kind of like sitting. You, you've kind of like. What? I, what do you mean? I didn't stand up. I threw oh, wait, off the no, tent. Threw, okay, so yeah, you're standing. So yeah, you can grapple them, and you get a plus four. Run by robot. Uh, do I put the fl the plus four into misc mod? Yes. Uh, just we'll just add for the roll. I would like uh, to clarify that Tucker private messaged me, basically telling me to 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 get in there. So it's not um, my fault. Hold on, let me check to see if I actually did this. Um, you said make it, him stop, so it, I said yeah, I'm gonna. Okay. It, it, it does not matter. You got him. You you got her. Because uh, damn it. So. So, uh, also, you, you don't, I, I would say that you don't quite know that it's Gaia. You kind of see that it is something inside your tent. So you just grab this, uh, you're, you grab your tent along with whatever's in it. And, uh, and, and to you, it kind of, it feels, it feels familiar. It feels familiar. <laughs> oh, that's I'm gonna a turn good to nice Griffin, point. And I'm going to say, go get Tim. He needs to see this. I found one. <laughs> <laughs> Griffin? Did we lose Griffud? No, he's right there. <sighs> okay. Griffin. Griffin! Go get him! What? I missed everything because I disconnected for like a good. Couple minutes. Oh, okay. Griffin, Gaia destroyed our tent. I, I heard that. Grapple her. 
And I'm telling you to go get Tim. Because I don't know who I have grappled. And uh, I want him to be the judge of what's about to happen. <laughs> I, 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 I'm going to unsling my bow. Because I'm on watch. So okay. I should probably have my weapon out. Okay. Uh, and um... I shall go get Tim. Okay. So Tim is in his tent. Tim. Wait, wait, wait. Wake so, up. Wait, so he's walking over there? To yeah. Wake him up? And I'm going to, like, stage whisper. Let the man sleep. He's been up for ten days. So, uh, Grafud... As Tim, wake up! We need, uh, we need help over here! So, uh, Grafud, despite <laughs> hearing this, you go ahead... You didn't mean for this to happen. You, you go ahead and yell uh, for, uh, oh for Tim. Uh, I and, just wanted uh, to stop an ass raping. And, and to your surprise, uh, you do not hear uh, Tim 2 respond. Tim 3 respond. Tim 4 respond. Damn it, it's important! We found an enemy! It tried to attack me and Griffin as we slept together. No, no, no. Enemy spot. I want to interject and just say, just say, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Can I please? Did you let me go? I'm going to look at her in surprise and say, <laughs> Is that you, witch? I'm not a witch! You Why did you destroy my back. tent? I, I don't know what. <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought you were getting raped. Hmm. This is a good claim. Matt, how much is a tent? Uh, I mean, you can still kind of you can still fairly easily repair your tent. More specifically, ah. Griffud could more easily repair your tent. Griffin's gonna go mm. fix something with his internet real quick. Okay. All right. Why were you near us? Stop a raping. Well, raping didn't really happen. Hmm. Okay. Well, I didn't know that. I also, I, yeah. So, so. so hmm. you apologized. That's good. So I, I <laughs> I'm going to say that Grafud uh, actually uh, barges into uh, Tim's <laughs> tent, and uh, he he ends up seeing um, he ends up seeing the man just kind of like. Like, I can't. You're roboting really bad. Yeah, really bad. I can't I? understand what you're saying, Matt. Oh, jeez, hold on. Let me see if that's a voice Okay, am am I still roboting? Yeah. yeah. Let me disconnect. Uh... Oh boy. Holy shit, that's so weird. Okay, so did that take care of things? <laughs> Uh, I think maybe Matt should turn off his video so that the audio. Yeah, could... that might help. Turn off the video. Oh. Oh yeah. Just for now. Oh. With the storm and all. Damn. <laughs> Hold on. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Tell me, is there still So, uh, what level is my, uh... Oh, god, yeah, no, I see what the problem is. 2,885 M. Might just be because it's storming. Yeah, that's... Tron that's... Legacy was a good movie. Okay, well, I'll, I'm gonna stop the recording, uh, because they they cannot Beep. understand me. Okay, so, I should be good now. Should be good. Okay, so, um... I'm uh, so Grafud. I I uh, I was making the claim that you probably entered the tent, correct? Because you did yeah. not hear any response from Tim to Tim three. Yeah, I did. So, uh, what you end up seeing is uh, uh, Tarak just uh, he he's just sitting there, kind of cross-legged. Uh, his he's kind of he's slumped over. Uh, his uh, hands are in his lap, but you can tell that like. He, he seems to be in a kind of trance. It's the ion stones. 
with my goddamn stones. Still up your <laughs> ass. Still up my asshole. Good. All right, can I move in closer? You can. You wish to investigate oh, him? I wish at to invest. At this point, I'm going to start climbing down the tower to deal with this. Okay. I wish to investigate closer on um, Tim 3, though. So Also, uh, I'd like to drop Gaia. I guess I got everything I got. But uh, I'd request that she helps fix the tent. Uh, I don't know how much of a help I'm really going to be. Uh... I mean, you could just give a plus two modifier to Griffin's repair. <laughs> yeah, you should do that. So, uh... Grafud, uh, upon closer inspection, you see that his eyes are wide open, uh, but there doesn't seem to be any thought there. Uh, his eyes are just wide open, and it kind of looks like his lips are moving, kind of in a chant, but but there's nothing. Yeah. I ch I'm going to wave my hand in front of him. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, slip in the door and move over to Grafud. And, like, silently gesture for him to get out. Like, wave him out. So... I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to push him away and say, fuck off. So, um... I'm gonna so, do a listen check. So, so, for babies. So, I'm gonna say that, uh, Grifud, right. you end up doing your uh, little wave in front of his face, uh, but there's no response. And then Balthazar comes in and tries to wave you out. You push him. Uh, so, roll a contested strength check. Oh god. Can I roll dex to avoid the push? You can, yes. It's not a hey, push, man. it's more of like a little, like, fuck, like, not so, a push. So, just but trying but... to wave him off? Okay. Yeah, like... Okay, so, so, nah, no, no reason. So, so it's not, it, yeah, it's not actually... Wait, Matt, I did a listen check. Yes, and, um, you're, you're able to hear the commotion inside, uh, inside Tim 3's, ch uh, tent. Well, it's not really we anything it's else. It's more him. Yeah. I'm just like, silently getting him out. Anything else? Babies? You also are able to hear uh, just the uh, dropping of water from uh, what must be stalactites above. Was that there before? Um, because he he nailed a listen check before also. It. Ah, uh, yes, he did. So, uh, yeah, yeah, that's been pretty constant throughout this uh, cave, which. Could mean that you guys are under a uh, a river, actually. Hmm. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna walk to the tent and see what's up. So, so you're just gonna leave guy alone and walk over to the tent? I mean, I, I like fine. to I like Dealt to with think the situation. that. I like to think that you're like strangling her practically with your uh, with your uh, grapple, and then and you're just she's like apologizing, and you're like repair the tent, and she's like I don't know how much help I can be, and then you just drop her and walk over to the tent. <laughs> Everything is so nonsensical, like just a bunch of random things are happening all at once. Yeah. So uh, Blarf goes over yeah, to the tent, and uh, you're able. So you peer inside, you see this little commotion going on. Uh, so... Get over here! It's rude to interrupt a man's sleep! Can I... I am, tell I am not... something's wrong? Oh. Uh, What's I wrong? I am not... Not... I'm not gonna fix the tent, and I'm gonna go over there also. Oh, I just deleted my person. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I'm sorry! I made a mark! Don't worry, I got this. I'll create a person for you. There you go. No, I'm gonna move. Up. No, 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 I'm no. I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna go over there. I don't want to fix the tent. I want to know what the fuck's going on. So I'm gonna stay over here. So Grafud uh, tells you, Blarf, that oh, okay. there is something wrong. I'm gonna tell both of them that, not just him. I'm I'm gonna just like try and wave everyone out. Like Whoa. I'm gonna whisper to Balthazar. What? The man's sleeping. Uh Thamior, you're also going to go see what's wrong? That ain't sleeping, my friend. That's, That's death. Witchcraft right there. He's in a <laughs> trance. He's just 
It's what he. It, it's his sleep. Just out, out. It's in his sleep. No, it's not. Hey, Tim. Tim. I'm gonna go up to Griffin and I'm gonna grapple him. You're going to <laughs> grapple Griffud? Well, of course, Griffud. Will you resist this grapple? I'm gonna resist this grapple. And Griffud, you are. Uh... Okay, so. Uh, Are you gonna Griffud? resist your so, master? So uh, go ahead and make a grapple check. Uh... Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and assist. Uh... Blarf. Yeah, okay. Okay. Blarf. Okay. Uh, so. So uh, that's going to add a plus two, which I know hits Fuck. Griffud. So. Uh, he is able to grapple you, Grafud. And I'm never going... able to fail the grapple. <laughs> and are you uh, going to resist, Grafud? I'll do. Res I'll resist. Wait, You're gonna wait, resist. So You're gonna resist. Go against me. So, whenever the grapple you go against issues, me. He, no, no. he landed his grapple. So yeah. now you have a chance to do an attack of opportunity, which oh, would yes, cancel that, the grapple. That part. I that being that. said, you would be punching Blarf. Women. Are you going against me? Uh, or are you just going to uh, let him grab you? I'll let him grab me. Okay. All but, right. um, uh, so, Blarf, you're trying to pull him out of the tent? I mean, I picked him up, and uh, we're going back to our tent. Okay, so as you're uh, pulling him out of the tent, Grafud, you are struggling, right? You're kind of kicking and... Yes. Okay. So, um, let me see. So, uh, you, so you guys are all pr very close to, uh, Turok. Uh, as you're, uh, as you're struggling, you manage to brush up against him, and then, poof. You d you just kind of, you, you, end up in this kind of area that everything seems kind of still and blue uh, to Balthazar and everyone else. To you guys, it looks as though Blarf and Grafud have frozen and are now in a trance themselves. Oh, what the hell? Can I not do a will check? Okay, wait. Can, can I go ahead and like because I, I think that Balthazar might have seen something similar to this, so he's going to make sure that he's wearing his gloves, and he's going to just, like, bat. Wait, is, Car is like, Tim 2 a wizard? Like, okay. Tim 3, excuse you. He he's going to, like, not, like, punch, but, like, yank uh, Grafud off. Uh, away from, uh, away from yeah. Turok? Yeah. Uh, so as you touch, uh, as you touch Where Grafud, a similar thing happens. You freeze up, and you end up, uh, in a very blue and, uh, and cold place. It's chaos control. Uh oh That was a shitty joke, I'm sorry. <laughs> Well, yeah. guess I'm not doing my watch. <laughs> so, uh, Th Thamior and Gaia, you are watching this, and you see that all all of your allies have ha are in some way uh, touching each other and have all frozen together. I'm not touching them. Not even gonna throw something at us to break. Uh, I'll throw my quarter staff. I'll throw my I'll I'll throw it like a javelin. Uh, at us? <laughs> yeah, you guys. Wait. You're gonna kill us! Who are, you, who are you throwing at? Um, throw it at Tim 3, because I don't, I don't necessarily like Tim 3's attitude. Okay, roll a dex, or a, uh... A I, ranged I, attack. Yeah, a ranged attack. It should be on um, your stats. So it should be four God, stats. Josie, if you kill uh, Wait, Josie, why don't you just use mage hand? Or actually, no, I'm you... gonna, no, I'm gonna <laughs> throw it. Uh, actually, you can throw your weapon, so if you go to your weapons and then you just switch the modifier to the dex, you can... I can just do a ranged attack, is that what you want? Yeah, yeah. Just do that. You're just gonna break another tent! So, uh, you, uh, <laughs> you toss your, uh, your, uh, quarterstaff, and it just kind of plops to the side and then leans up against, uh, 
and it it leans up against Tim. Really? Yes. <laughs> this is so bullshit. Damn, you're do some so do some vine shit. Find us out of here, man. Maybe if you break my goddamn tent. Break the tent. Oh, boy, break all familiar. the tents while you're at it. <laughs> I like how Bluff cares more for his tent than his follower. <laughs> yeah. My so, follower might not be my follower with the actions he's done. So, Thamior, what are you going to do? <laughs> um, Lives are at wow. stake. And tents. <laughs> Tents aren't at really at stake here. Yes, they are. No, they're not. This is the chance, Samir. Like you have to destroy them. At the moment. It's the, it's the tent. It's the um, tent. So so hmm. so Thamior and uh oh gosh and uh, Gaia, you are not going to be touching anyone. I'm not touching anyone. Okay. I mean, you could knock the tent I down. Probably not. This. Probably not. Okay. So, let's go over to, uh, the other four. So, um... Other four? What? We're there! So... Oh, shit! It's Tim 3.0, a robot, and are we in Cyber Chase? <laughs> so, so, Blarf, you are holding Grafud. He's kicking around... <laughs> Um, it's hacker. Balthazar, you just uh you are now holding on to Grafud and uh immediately uh I, I'm actually mm. Wait, so are we still connected? You are all still uh connected, yes. Okay. This is really fucking uh, weird. However, <laughs> you also <laughs> notice that uh well actually uh, yeah, within all of the commotion, uh it doesn't take long for Probably Balthazar to notice that Tim Three is not there. Uh, it it looks as though it's just you three here, uh, in the tent by yourselves. Uh, again, Grafud so, is kicking around and struggling out of Blarf's uh, control, or at least uh, trying uh, to. I'm gonna go ahead and tell both of them to stop. You guys <laughs> fucked this up. You. Yep. I tried to tell y'all something was wrong. Fucking Griffin fucked us up. Griffin. Griffin, are you my gonna say, or not? As far as we know, we are no longer in their same plane of existence. Is this a, is this Put differences thing? aside for now, <laughs> and let's just try and figure out what the hell's going on. I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. I'm gonna do a listen check for a baby. <sighs> Uh, for anything, really. Baby included. So, I'd um, like to. <laughs> so, uh, so, so... Wait! Wait, wait, wait. Can I use arcane knowledge? Oh, yeah. Uh, yes, Grafud, you can. Uh, Blarf, uh, what you're able to hear, uh, well, for one, you don't hear any water droplets. In fact, what you hear is kind of a deafening, unnatural silence. Cyber That's not right. So, uh, Grafun, you're, you're, you don't you don't really know anything of what's happening. Mm. All right. Yeah. I've decided something on this other plane. Can I just like jump in the middle of them all? Well, guy, you're uh, get you're you're not there. In fact, you don't know what's happening. No, but like no, like, Wait, on the I, other plane, like I, on the other just... side. Can I just jump in? Are, 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 are you going to body slam one of them? Oh, oh, wait, you're, gonna, like, you're, touch... you're, you're going to, uh, touch one of them now? Yeah, I wanna, but I don't just want to touch them, I just want to go full on, I, like, they're, I'm imagining they're all aware of sorts, or, like, they're all touching each other, I just want to, like, dogpile all of them. Just touch all four of them at once. So, so you're gonna, like, tackle us? Yes, basically. Let's I want to get in on this, I want to see what happens, like, do I just appear there, or do I, like... So, I just fade into so uh, just before you're, uh, you're, you're about to take a running start, and just before you do, you <laughs> kind of hear these, uh, actually, I want you and Thamior to roll a listen check. This is oh, not good! It's good oh, as boy. 
I'm not going to be a part of this. Daniel's going to be the one projecting us. I don't, I'm going to jump in anyways. Uh, Life's listen checks are godly. So, Thamior, uh, since you're not planning to do anything yet, you, you kind of end up hearing these whispers. Uh, and it sounds like a multitude of whispers. Some it, it sounds like some of the whispers are coming from inside the tent. You can kind of hear uh, what what sounds like you know uh, what it, it sounds like Balthazar trying to uh, stop some fighting. Uh, Is this like the upside down? But uh, that's not, that's wait, 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 wait. Uh, what if I did that? Bal Balthazar is going to. Go ahead, and uh, he is going to say, da, 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 da. "Marvel de lum eques ver honoret ingelarier." The fuck does that mean? There's that phrase. Uh, Thamior is able to overhear this, and uh, he, he, you're able to overhear them as more of a whisper, so you don't quite catch it. Uh, but also, Thamior, I want you to note that you're able to hear some noises coming from the darkness. They also <laughs> sound like whispers. Um, oh boy. Gaia, you do not jump hear in? this. So, yep, Gaia runs and jumps into the middle of you four. <laughs> so, so t t to be clear, to be clear, is this a... Th this is like you actively, like, you jumped as you were running? Yeah. Right? I jumped and I like, it's like when you're doing like, what so are they the called? Que the question is, is she going to freeze in the air on top of us? Or yeah, is she going to knock us all yes. down? As, uh, well, yeah, as soon as she jumps in order to get in between all of you, as soon as she touches anyone, she freezes in midair. Nice. And uh and Balthus Wait, who wait, who'd she touch? Who'd she touch? Uh let's roll a 1d4 to find out. All right. me and my dick. So uh starting with Tim, he is 1, Grafud is 2, Balthazar is 3 and Blarf is 4. Yes. Please be me. So she touches Grafud uh, you are yeah. trying to, uh, I would assume, trying to separate, uh, every, you know, probably the most focal point, uh, who is touching all three of you, and freezes right up against him. Uh, you guys in the other plane just see Gaia fall from thin air against the ground. Um, with a thud. Josie. Just, um, <laughs> Matt. You. Uh, can you think of any swears that would be like native to elephant's tusk uh swears uh native to elephant's tusk probably along the lines of uh it, it uh it would be along the line of uh carnival slang so or uh just animals so you know you could be like oh you smell like like bear shit or something like that you know like just simple things like that are uh common common slang and insults in elephant's tusk what do, what what swears do elves have? Elves? Yeah. Uh, what can I say? A, a uh. lot a lot of you you guys uh, a lot of things that come along of uh, you guys being mortal or being so so human like. Uh, Griffud, I'm fucking human. Yeah, Griffud, you probably don't have uh, very many of those because you're half human, half elf. So you fucking so, human. So, uh, hey, yeah. I'm so I got fucked still. So, uh, so, so four of you guys are in this other r realm, Thamior. You are able to hear whispering from the darkness, and you're, you are very unsure as to what is, uh, where it is coming from. But you are able to hear it, and you do not... You probably do not feel very comfortable with it. <laughs> probably. As in, like, someone might feel okay with it. Yeah. Yo, Thamuel, get me out. Uh, well, oh, you don't know I'll that uh, he can hear you blarf. So, um... So, you guys... Uh... Again, everything's kind of blue and cool, and, uh... You know, despite... Despite being inside a tent, which is normally warm it feels 
unnaturally like like there's a breeze kind of coming in from the uh, tent. Josie, can 